Hello everyone and welcome back to more Warm Robber. Today we're taking on the FIA office again, but this time we're gonna loot the vault and we're gonna loot all the statues stealthily. And for this heist, all you're gonna need is a hacking device and a lockpick. Also tier three and all the stealth skills. So without further ado, let's get this heist started. When we first start this heist, you wanna grab your kit, grab your duffel bag and place a lockpick and a hacking tool inside. And you wanna head to the front of the FIA office. Once we get to the front gate, you wanna take immediate right. Go around this guard box, head over to the SWAT cars over here, take it me at left from the SWAT cars. Once we get past these black vans, the guards should move. We'll head up these stairs to the roof, take it me at left, and we're gonna drop down right in front of the front door. Once inside, we're gonna hide behind this pillar, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna wait until the guard in the middle here goes back to this post over here. Once he moves, we're gonna head over here, jump over the rope, head over to the utility room, Take your hacking tool and hack this utility door. Once this door is hacked, place the hacking tool back in your duffel bag, shut off the alarm, take your gun and shoot out this window in particular. It should trigger a guard to go and investigate. He'll actually go upstairs. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna follow him. But we're gonna take a meat left, shove this civilian a little bit, and we're gonna wait until this guard passes. Once he does, close this door, make sure none of the civilians see us. We're gonna take out our gun, shoot this camera. No guard should worry about it. Head up these stairs. We're gonna tie up both these civilians and we're gonna push them so the civilian inside will see it. He'll come to investigate, tie him up. And now we're gonna push the civilians into this corner away from the camera. Make sure you shoot this window before that guard comes back. And now we're gonna wait for that guard to come back. Once this guard comes back, he'll see the civilians get alerted. We'll shoot the guard, take his phone. We'll go through the conference room right here. Go through this door, do the check-in and close the door right behind us. Hop out the window that we shot earlier. Take your gun and shoot this window. A guard from downstairs should get alerted and he'll come to investigate. So now we're gonna wait until this guard comes to investigate. Now be careful, there's a guard in the break room that might spot you. So what we're gonna do is try to avoid his attention. As we wait for this guard from earlier to come up these stairs and get a little bit closer before we take him out which is right now. We're gonna take his phone. We're gonna go over to this window, jump through the break room and do the check-in over here. Next, we're gonna jump out the window again, head back through the conference room window, head back downstairs. And we're gonna zip tie this civilian and we're gonna wait. The reason why we're tying up this civilian in particular because the guard around the corner here is gonna spot him and we'll do the next step. So once he has line of sight of him, he'll come to investigate. We'll shoot him. We're gonna grab his phone. We're gonna go up these stairs real quick. Go out the conference room window. Know where the guard is. The guard is right underneath us. So we're gonna jump. Go around this thing, we're gonna go to the guard box, we're gonna place the phone down, open up the door, grab the phone again, and do the check-in. Close this door, we're gonna go around the SWAT vehicles. Now we're gonna wait for this guard to move. Once this guard moves, we're gonna go up these stairs again, go in through the conference room window. And now we're gonna head back downstairs. And just to be safe, once we get down these stairs, we're gonna zip tie all these civilians. This civilian in particular though, you wanna push into this room before zip tying. Close this door, and now we're gonna hide underneath this pillar. And once we get to this point, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna wait until this guard down here actually comes all the way down here before we shoot this camera. Once he's about there, shoot the camera. We're gonna shoot the guard. Tie up the civilian, take the phone, do the check-in over here. Next, we're gonna hop over the rope, hop over the desk. You wanna push the civilian away from the window. Zip time right here. We're gonna hop on the desk and we're gonna shoot the camera, shoot the guard, grab his phone, go through the metal detector here. Watch out for the civilians. Hang a right, hug the building as much as you can. Go down to this guard box. Open this door, take the phone, do the check-in right behind this guard, not to get spotted. Close the door. We're gonna hug the wall. Come around here. 
And now we're going to take care of these two civilians. The way we're going to do that is actually we're going to push them. One civilian might see you. Don't tie them up right away. Just keep pushing them. And what we're going to do is push them down the stairs. We're going to push both these civilians down the stairs. Once they get to right here, tie them. They should be good and out of sight. And now we should be able to loot all the statues in the front half of the FIA office. So there's eight statues in total that we can get. There's four in this side alley and there's four in the front here. Now, when you get these close ones, these close ones should be easy. The two guards you have to worry about is the guard over there by the guard box and this guard outside this window. Try not to get caught by them when you're getting these two far ones. There should be eight statues in total. Next, we're gonna go to the vault stage, get your hacking tool, unlock the first door to the vault. Once you unlock it, place the hacking tool back in your duffel bag, grab your duffel bag and head down these stairs. There should be two guards down here. We're gonna take them both out and do the check-in on the wall. After we do the check-in, we're gonna grab our duffel bag, grab our lock pick and unlock this first door. Once that's done, go to the vault door, take your hacking device out and hack the next door. After this is done, you're done with the hacking tool. Next, grab your lock pick and unlock this door. Once that's done, you're done with the lock pick. Shoot all the glasses. Now loot everything into the duffel bag. Now our bag's a little empty, but we'll take two of the little pieces of art that we can take, which is this one and this one. Once you have it like an angle like that, grab the duffel bag. And this is the route we're gonna take to get out of here. We're going to simply go to the elevators, go up these stairs. Make sure not to get spotted by the camera down the hallway. Go out the window of the conference room. And now we're going to wait. We're going to see where this guard is. The guard's right underneath us. So what we're going to do is hop over here. Now, if this guard moves into this position, he's a little bit close. So what we're going to do is just wait until he moves back to his original post before moving again. Once he does, we're gonna take immediate left. And now we can head back to the truck. And we're simply gonna keep doing this until we have all the art pieces. And once we get the last piece of artwork, we can head back to the truck and end the heist. And as you can see, our total take is $153,000. We can end the heist. And this was the FIA office, fully looted stealthily. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe to help the channel grow. And I'll see you in the next video.